Hi everyone, I am Manon, industrial design intern at Lumia, and in this video I will help you get up and running with a backlit button hookup that turns the backlight on and off each time you press it. The single backlit button is a simple mechanical switch that comes with an LED inside. When you press the button, the circuit is completed, driving your pin high or low. You can use the embedded LED to make a glowing power icon, a logo or whatever suits your fancy. For this tutorial you'll need the following, a Lumia backlit button component, a breadboard, an Arduino and connector cable, jumper wires, a 1 kilo ohm resistor, alligator clips and if you'd like a piece of fabric, double sided tape and a vinyl sticker. So let's wire up the circuit. First use the alligator clips to attach your backlit button component to the breadboard and Arduino. Next we'll provide power to the LED using ground and a GPO pin. You'll then detect when the button is open or closed using a GPO pin that is pulled down with the 1 kilo ohm resistor. After you'll connect the other side of the button to Vi volts. If you want to test your part to see if it's working well, hook up a battery or power supply on Vi volt to the ground and a Vi volt line and the backlit button should light up. Once everything is hooked up, use the example code from our tutorial to operate the button. Simply copy and paste it into your Arduino IDE. The serial monitor should print out one each time you press the button and you should also see the light go on and off with each press. You might have to press firmly and slowly to get a good reading. Experiment with adding debouncing and changing the delay time to get faster readings. If you'd like you can prepare a fabric overlay by sticking a cut vinyl sticker to your fabric. You can cut a sticker by hand with a crafting blade or using a CNC tool like a Cricut cutter. The LED is about a 1 inch diameter so any icon inside a 1 inch diameter circle should work well. Thank you for viewing this tutorial and see you next time. Visit lumia.com slash for more tutorials and useful guides.